Hi everyone, so I'm deciding to vlog today. Um, yeah. You say hi? Hi. So, me and my son are heading to my niece's birthday party today. So, I'm deciding to bring you guys with me. Um, we're, right now, we're waiting for a Walmart grocery pickup. I live an hour away from a Walmart that has a grocery pickup, so whenever we come into town, I, I do a little grocery haul, but I only get things, I only get things that um, are mostly like um, beverages and, and pantry items, things that could be warm because I'm not going to be back until later on because um, the party hasn't started yet, but... So I needed things that are able to stay in my trunk, but I think they're on their way now. So just going to bring you guys along with me for the day and let's see what we do. So we are at a red light right now. Um, we got here in the town super early because I had that grocery pickup and I just didn't know how long it would take. <laughs> but um. It's one o'clock, this party doesn't start till two, so I called my niece and she would like some birthday donuts. So right now we're gonna head to Dunkin' Donuts and get some for her and now we're leaving. This is funny, I was just at that stoplight right over there, you can't see, and there was no one in the Dunkin' Donuts line. And now I get here, which is only crossing the corner, and now I am the fourth car in line. I guess everybody wanted donuts at the same time. Ooh wee, ooh wee, ooh wee. So I got a dozen donuts for my niece. And she only likes strawberries and that Boston cream. Oh, yeah, okay. Strawberries with sprinkles. I love donuts. So I had to get me a half dozen. But there's two vanilla, two strawberry, and two maple. I love donuts almost as much as my son. No, I'm just kidding. And I know donuts shouldn't be life right now because <laughs> of this, but kind of are. Donuts are life. Mm. It's so good though. <sighs> I know. I just want to sit for a second since I'm super early. And just... Did I mention that I'm kind of nervous? <laughs> I'm kind of nervous. This is going to be the first gathering since, you know, things started opening back up little by little. Um, But just last night, I had read that that there was a family party... And then after that party, 18 family members got the coronavirus. Did anyone else read that? And like, to the grand, um, like, out of the 18 family members, the grandparents, the grandma and grandpa are expected to die. And so now, and this is right before, you know, our family gathering. So my cousin, who's the mom of my niece, um, she's a registered nurse so i'm hoping she is just a little get together i don't know how many people are gonna be there but i think if i feel uncomfortable i'm either gonna put a mask on me and my son or we're gonna we're gonna probably go early because i'm still kind of nervous about all this socializing stuff but all right i guess we're gonna head over there now Hi everyone, 
so just a quick update I didn't vlog too much at the birthday party because my son was running around like a crazy little guy and I was just chasing him back and forth back and forth and they had a gate open in the backyard so I was so scared he was gonna run out of there and that gate just leads into the street so luckily my cousin and my nieces they just love him so they're letting me have a little break so I escaped the party for a few minutes I'm gonna just do a little browsing I'm gonna come in, go into Ross right now I'll probably stop at Marshall's and I need to pick up a couple things at Walmart but let's see what we can find in Ross okay guys so I'm done with Ross um, I'm gonna give you guys a little haul of what I bought first I bought this little trash can for my bathroom I saw it and it was only $4.99 I believe $5.99 but I loved it because it was the same color as my bathroom and I love that print on it. I thought that was so cute. I just got this coat rack. I've been looking for one for a very long time. So I just happened to walk across that. So I got that in my bag. I got some silicone straws because I didn't like the copper ones that I had got those. I just got some work pants. I got a couple tops and then for the Burlington haul I had found a couple name brand shorts for my son but I couldn't find the tops so I went in solely looking for some tops to match his shorts. get in here just got another Nike shirt pretty much the same as I just gray focus focus and I got an eyelash curler it was only $2.99 what else I got me I found me a Reebok shirt that's what that looks like Sorry, guys, you're all over the place. <laughs> There's that. And then I also got me a Nike shirt. Oh, but it is so hot. I still got... I'm probably just going to stop at Walmart. Oh, I was wanting to stop at Marshall's. But it is so hot that I don't know if I can. It's, let's see, 99 degrees. Ooh, and I need a dust. I'm judging the car. Okay, guys. So let's see if I go to another store or not. Okay, the next haul we did was from Michaels and oh my goodness I had to control myself in there because all the spring and summer stuff was 70% off and there were so many cute things but I knew if I just started going crazy I would spend hundreds of dollars over there so the first thing I got was a sign it says stay a while but I thought that would be cute to go over my TV in the living room for when I do my living room makeover and originally it was $40, but it was 70% off, so it rang up for $12. And then $12.99. 12 for $12.99. And then they had all these galvanized like baskets and vases and stuff. Those are also 70% off, so this was $16.99. I forgot how much this rang up. I just had them email me the receipt, so I didn't print it out. But all these little flowers, too, originally they were $9.99, but I found a little section where they were only $5, and then plus the 75 the 70% 70 off of that. So each one of these was $3 each, and I got 
let me see, I think I got four. Four little bouquets of those. And then I got this cute little stand. It was only, I think it came out to only $3, but originally it was eight. Okay. And then I got another cake stand there that was also $3. So that is all I kind of splurged on at Michael's, but man, there was so much over there. I just couldn't, I could go through every aisle and just spin, 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 but I only got the stuff that I really, I just thought, what do I really need? <laughs> what do my makeovers will not need. You, you don't need any of this, but what are the things I really, really want? Okay, so let's see if we go to another store or not. We're gonna stop in the Hobby Lobby and then probably peek in the Marshalls, which is right over there. Everything fall is already out here at Hobby Lobby. Ooh. This is really what I popped in here for. But why are faux trees so expensive? Like $100 cheapest I see is 80 yeah. the cheapest here is 80 and I don't want to spend that much on a fake tree eh. even the stems to potentially make your own tree is $30 and there's no sale Darn it. I don't think I'm that ambitious anyways so Hobby Lobby was a fail. Everything was so expensive and nothing was on sale. So Michael's is definitely the way to go for sales right now for home decor. But we're gonna pop into Marshalls, so. Okay guys, Whew. it is hot. I think that's it for me. Marshalls was also a fail. I walked in there when, God, this eyeliner just bleeding too. I walked in there when they only had 10 minutes until closing, so I kind of just checked boy shoes for my son and then headed out. But I think that's it. I think I'm going to go back to the party, pick up my son, and head home, and I'm probably just going to call it a day. So, I'll see you guys in a bit. pickup it's a small very very small little Walmart haul um, but I went ahead and just got some tomato paste some tomato sauce more fabric softener and the scent beads my son loves 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 these rice with chicken got him those tomato I mean spaghetti sauce shells spaghetti noodles and some crackers. Um, remember, this is all everything that was able to just stay in my trunk yesterday because I wasn't gonna go home right away. Um, and also what I got in this order, that's not right here, but I got a case of waters and a bottle of apple juice for my son. And I think I got two bottles of that actually. And then I got a case of Coke Zero. So, and then I also wanted to record um, a better Ross haul from the one yesterday because you guys know I was struggling <laughs> with the heat and I couldn't really take everything out of the bags and, and show it real well. So I wanted to go ahead and do that for you as well. Okay, so here was the close of that Ross haul. You guys saw that I bought that trash can and that coat rack and the straws and the eyelash curler, but I really wasn't able to take out the clothes because I was just frustrated. So I decided to come on here and show you a little in depth what I what I bought so um, for my son I bought him an Adidas shirt that was $5.99 a Nike shirt I think I showed you guys this one also $5.99 another Nike shirt 
$3.99. Can't beat those prices. Then I got him some Jordan, just athletic shorts for $7.99. And then these ones are so cute with the 23. Oh, I love them. But $4.99, five bucks for that. Oh my goodness. So then on to me, I just got me a couple pieces. I got me this Reebok shirt. It's um, it was ten ninety nine. There wasn't the tag though, but he typed in, he typed it in and looked it up. And then I got me a Nike shirt right here that was twelve ninety nine. These are just casual for just running errands or for the house. And I wanted really loose fitting clothes. And then. This was $10.99. This is a really, really loose fitting shirt, but I like this little detail on it. I was gonna get the white one too, but I have some clothes coming in the mail and I think I ordered one that's already similar. So decided not to get that. And then I will be going back to work soon, within the next couple weeks, I hope. So I just got me another pair of work pants and these were just $6.49 on clearance. So that was all for the clothes and that's the end of today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed my little haul and coming on the day with me. Thank you so much. Um, so I don't know what the next video is going to be. I really, really see all that stuff over there. That's all my craft stuff, but I'm planning on moving that shelf into my closet, but my closet is a crazy disaster. So that might actually be... The next little organization video that I might have to do but hope you guys have a res good rest of your night and sub subscribe if you haven't and once again I thank you for watching see you on the next one bye mm -hmm.